Okay, I'll just do all the castles so you don't have to look at the... Ooh, can you just do all the castles yeah, and that way yeah, that. we know where they go? Yeah, I'll do it real quick. Oh, okay. Just yeah, just follow the line up with the castles. Just follow That's the what pattern. I'm doing. I'm getting to a point where like the yeah. pattern exists yeah. and I can just go, man, do, man, do, man, do, man, do, do, castle, yeah. castle, castle. <laughs> it's kind of insane that it does that. It's I have... I don't, fun, though. I don't remember that in the other puzzles. It was after we found it after we did the puzzle. And yeah, a little frustrating, but they don't, there are pattern breakers, so sure, sure, sure. it's it fun until you get a, a pattern breaker. It wasn't a circle. True, because eventually you have to go in. Well, each circle, each concentric ring gets smaller. See my bruise in my arm. Ooh! I ran into the door at work. For some reason, the bathroom door has like is like the heaviest door on the planet. Yeah. So you like push it open, and immediately it's just like nah. And it's like <laughs> you don't want to. It won't be a problem at the new building because the new building has automatic doors. You wave your hand in front of a, a panel on the wall, and the door opens. For wow. You. Very slow. It's gonna add a lot of time to your bathroom <laughs> breaks, but salary, man, it doesn't matter how many bathroom breaks you take. <laughs> is or that how, how long? It works. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Okay. It doesn't matter how long it takes. Okay. It's your salary. So exactly. It's free bathroom break. Well, we bathroom have... breaks shouldn't be I know, it's a, counted against to be you anyway. anyway but... <laughs> that's trauma from working at the daycare. Oh, okay. Because either okay. we didn't get them or we had to clock out. <laughs> <It's> like, what? <laughs> yeah, there's a girl on TikTok who does mm -hmm. uh, daycare, uh, uh, daycare skits. Mm. And oh my gosh, I get into it. I'm like, okay, move on. Okay, what happened next? <laughs> it's like, dang, it's over. <laughs> yeah. Because it's on TikTok, so it doesn't last very long. I think we're up to three minutes now. Yeah, and three minutes goes by really fast when you're really into a story. Gotta take that medication. Mm -hmm. Gotta get those drugs in the system. If you want me to stay here. Oh. I feel bad because on Sundays I've been crashing. Sometimes Mondays too. And I feel bad because it's like I'm always crashing whenever I'm with my dad. Yeah. I'm sorry. Dad gets the worst of me. True. To the, all his fault, he impregnated me. <laughs> well, I mean, you can, it's a choice, right? You make the choice to stay with your spouse every day. Oh, right. Yeah? <laughs> this is a choice. Is it? Legally <laughs> obligated. Uh, it's really expensive to leave. I'm teasing. I'm teasing. I'm teasing. If you are in an unhealthy relationship, you should leave. Yes. I've been randomly looking at your side to make sure they don't go anywhere. They I... do go in a pattern with each other, because, like, this one... No, 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 I'm talking about the weird... On the edge, the two rows that are different. Right, but they still do, see? No, they don't. Okay. Because I have this one, which mm -hmm. is connected to a castle and a man. Oh, nothing. okay. There's nothing. But what above it yeah, is so, a weird piece. Yeah, so, like, the, the first row will have a castle and a man, but the next row up will have a spacer in between it. These are oh, just, like, okay. spacers gotcha. because the next row is... The concentric circle is smaller. Yeah. You know. I got it. Science, man. Ugh. Science is hard. It's really hard. Science has always been very hard for me. Math is hard. No. Science is hard. It's just whenever you bring math into the science, it's like, oh. Did you have to have, uh, I, I don't remember, accounting in high school? No. You didn't have to take I took accounting? accounting in, in uh, college. Wow. We had to do accounting, and that was my favorite class. Because it was keeping books. It taught you how to, you know, keep books and do the... It was basically a spreadsheet yeah, that's, before computers. I thought I thought accounting was stupid because it was literally just spreadsheets. Yeah, and I was like, oh, we're just learning Excel, which I already yeah. had another class for because I had a class for Excel, right? Because whenever you're in IT, you have to take True. 
a whole class for like each of the office products essentially yeah so i had at the, at the same time i had accounting which was just filling out spreadsheets <laughs> And then I had a database SQL, which was filling out databases, which is basically a bunch of spreadsheets yes. in a big book um, digitally. And then I had an Excel class. <laughs> so just you doing took the that same all thing. the same. Well, yeah, I was oh just doing gosh. the same thing, like in every class. Different. That's. I was like, here's 15 ways to do the same yeah. thing. Yeah. That would be annoying. Yeah. Yep, yeah. and it's all made up, and none of it's real. <laughs> I said that I was, if only <laughs> I forgot my computer on Wednesday I yeah guess. I, yeah, I left my computer at home it, I'm so mad about this let me just tell you how Wednesday happened okay <laughs> oh gosh I'll just break this down for everybody I got so just <laughs> um so I get up and I was like I'm not gonna do eyeshadow makeup today I'm gonna go mascara eyeliner lipstick I don't feel like doing anything so I leave the house early, I get my coffee, I stop at the coffee shop, get a coffee, and I get to work, and I'm like 20 minutes early. Like it's, I'm like almost like, no I wasn't 20 minutes early, I was like 10 minutes early, but I was like on time, right? I was walking, Which never happened. Walked in and sat down on time, and I was like, whenever I was walking to my desk, I was like, my bag feels a little light. I probably just left like my drawing stuff at home, no big deal. Sit down, open it, nope, left my laptop. <laughs> And just, Which is one of the most important things that you need. It's the only thing I need for work. Yes. That and my cell phone. So I look around the empty trailer that I sit in, that I got to on time for the first time ever. And I just go, all right. So I message the guy at the desk, like, hey, I need to loan a laptop for today. Um, And I already know I'm going to lunch with my parents at, yes. at noon. So I'm like, well, after lunch, I'll just go home and work from home the rest of the afternoon. No big deal. So I go over to help us to get this loaner laptop. It takes them two hours to give me the laptop. Good grief. Because, of course, that's the day they started auditing and re-imaging all of the loaners. So they don't have one that I can take. So after two hours, I finally get back to my desk and do an hour of work before I go to lunch. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I messaged my boss on my way. I was like, hey, I have my laptop at home. So I'm going to go to lunch with my parents and then go home and work from home. He's like, okay. Just be online. And I was like, yeah. It's been a day. Because we go to lunch every Wednesday. Yeah, I didn't know that. Yeah, so. It's kind of crazy that he remembers that. Because he's always like, what are you doing for lunch today? I'm like, oh, it's going to be. He's like, oh, you're going to lunch with the pigs. No big deal. <laughs> My old boss could not. <laughs> so every week I was like, I'm going to lunch. He's like, oh, where are you going? I'm like, yeah. Do you have a week? Not both of you, but you know. I understand completely. Usually yes. I say my mom. It's always me, but it could be me and Corey. It could be me and your dad. I've brought Samantha before. Mm -hmm. I mean, if Samantha didn't work so far away. Although, can I say what I appreciate the most is that you tell me if it's not just you. Oh, really? Yeah. You appreciate that? So much, because I... Oh. And the type of person that you need to prepare for any situation, like mentally, right. to be in the right mental place for that. Well, and I don't like surprising you. I mean, I don't, not good it's you. not, I don't like surprises like that, so I don't do it to other people. So well, it's just like, if I know ahead of time, I will usually yeah. tell you and Samantha if something else is happening. If I don't know and it happens, I apologize profusely. Because, like, a lot of, like, friends and stuff would be like, we're going out. I'm like, okay, but who's going? Yes. Yeah. I need to know that. That's a very important factor. Yes. In, in going out. Going out. <laughs> yeah. You need to be prepared getting out with those people. Well, and I think you should. I mean, I don't know. I just think it's a common I, sense time. Yeah, it should be. So, I appreciate it. You are welcome. That's the first piece I've gotten in in a long time. <laughs> Don't cry. It's going to be okay. Oh, that feels so good. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That's what it feels like for pieces of it. <laughs> I think this puzzle's not. I think this puzzle's a toxic relationship, honestly.
<laughs> I think you're right. <laughs> This is why I get excited because it's so exciting. It's so exciting. It's like the most chill hobby you could possibly have. Mom's like, let's fuck it. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but to be fair, I would make anything hyper, you know. You know, I'm not a chill person. That's for sure. I'm really not. I'm a very Nice, strong. Yeah. I just get so excited. It's exciting. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got my chill from dad. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad does his all behind doors. That's not fair. I mean, I'm the same way. I yeah. have things that I get excited about, but I don't do it in front of people. Right. And that's just not fair because you called still have the same trauma. no. Yes. That's called uh what's it called? Uh oh, no not showing your excitement. Having is this having what's it called? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Dang it. It's called being reserved, having Ah, never mind. <laughs> Stop it, because that just that's, makes me not think of the word even even more. But that's the word that it no, it's be. not the word that I was looking for. Control? It. Yeah, control on your emotions. Well, I have none. Actually, it is having an immense amount of control over your emotions is a, it's a good trauma. Thing. It's a good thing. Yeah, Dad, the most emotionally controlled person you've ever met. <laughs> He's so chill. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What other lies do you have for us today? Tell me more. It's just so chill. Kelsey needs food. Me? I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff out. Sounds like projecting. And what's wrong with that? Is there is that something wrong? Yeah, it means you're hiding from your own problems and putting them, making them somebody else's problem. And that's wrong. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Other people have their own problems. They don't. This is forced. your therapy session, not mine. That is not how this works. Yes. Absolutely. Nope. Absolutely not. Yep. Nope. 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 Yep. No. Yeah, how annoying it is when somebody yep. just says no to you the whole yep. time. I just, yep. The Katrina? Katrina. Katrina! Is that a. Do you watch that YouTube? Thing? No, I just. <laughs> okay. Yeah, incidental. Yeah, I was, I was like, I don't think you guys know this reference. <laughs> I'm very confused. Yes, this is the right place. Read the words in front of your face, man. The number of times I've had like end users like um not read the they'll be like, what does this error message mean? And the error message will be like, the file path is too long. I'm like, what? The file path is too long. There's not. It's not a... <laughs> Brain not computing. Don't understand. Beans. Ew. This place also sells like fr French fry nachos, and like I'm really tempted to just like get their fries because like uh, the idea of a Mexican place, like getting like making really good fries is weird to me. That is kind of odd. There's actually uh, drivers out there that will decline if you don't pay twenty percent. Yeah. You get less work done. We could just sit in a boring old trailer we done, all right? day and, okay. and just do fake work. Well, I mean, working, being in, okay, obviously I've never driven food to people's places, houses, but being a waitress, I understand the importance of tipping. Yeah. So, yes, I always tip. Yeah, always. Sure. I'm not saying don't do that. Yeah. I tip. 
It's just that I, <laughs> I think it's silly that we have a society that relies on paying the people's employees by tipping instead of just like increasing the prices. Or... I did go out and look at that, by the way. Oh. The lowest paying job I found was ten dollars an hour. That was hiring. Well, yeah. And that was a waitress. That was on like a, a site, but like a lot of the no. lowest paying jobs aren't gonna post on like job sites. They'll be like the dog groomer down the street, you know what I mean? Well, there was waitresses at like Taco or yeah, Taco Bell. There was uh, not waitresses Those at Taco corporate, Bell, but um, there was Brahms. There was little places, uh, little mom and pop restaurants. Um, there was also a receptionist, which Good, was twenty eight to thirty dollars for a receptionist. So... Yeah, ten dollars. Well, receptionists you're usually required to have a college degree. No. Yeah. No, not, not for. Just usually you have to have like two, two. Well, I'm saying on this one, no, no. There but, was like. I looked at all non-college degree. Ten dollars is still way too low. Uh, for unless, entry unless level. Unless you're not paying mm. like for housing and your groceries. Think it's entry. I think it is, because not everybody who's an entry person is a sixteen-year-old. You know what I mean? Oh, well, no, I didn't say that. I'm just saying. But, like, for $10 an hour, you couldn't afford rent for an apartment, like a one-bedroom apartment. I don't think $10 an hour would be for somebody that's trying to get to have an apartment, I think. Then what? They just are homeless? No, they're teenagers. That's what I'm saying. Is not oh. everybody entry level is a teenager. Gotcha. So everybody making $10 an hour needs to be able to pay rent. Mm. Yeah. That's usually, I mean, not all of those jobs. Can, and plus, I shouldn't. I'm going to agree. Our disagree. service industry shouldn't rely on child labor <gasps> either. Like, right. that's crazy to me. Agreed. Okay, I need the cats. What are you doing over there? Uh, we're just hanging on by the skin of our teeth. Ooh. Yeah, there's no skin on teeth. Why do people say that? You know, it's really interesting. I was watching a video of like. It was a Japanese guy, a Welsh guy, and a uh, Turkish guy. Uh huh. And they were talking about like colloquial phrases. Yeah. Like apple of my eye. Yeah. But the way that it was interpreted for the Japanese guy, it was like he eats my eye. Oh. Or he. Oh. Yeah, something like that. It was like the weird translation, which yeah. whenever it says that. And then like for the Turkish guy, the way they translate theirs is like the oil of my eye. Oh. Yeah, and it's the same thing. It's the same phrase. He's the apple of my eye. You know what I mean? Yeah, but Which, if you think about that word, is weird too. Yeah. Um. I, no, I think the Japanese was like he's in my eye or something like that. I don't. Know. Whatever. All of those phrases are weird. <laughs> but it was interesting to hear like the different versions of that phrase. Of that right. Yeah. Translated back into English. Because <laughs> like he was translating that, and the Welsh guy was just like, "What the fuck? What's happening?" <laughs> And the whole chat was like, apple of my eye. That's what he's trying to say. You people are weird. Because <laughs> it was like a grandpa talking about his grandson or whatever. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I used to be, my grandfather would say, and I'm sure you've heard this a million times, but my grandfather would say, have you seen my pride and joy? Yes. And it would be a picture of pride and joy, not his grandchildren. <laughs> the soap. <Can> <laughs> He kept it in his wallet to say that oh. joke every time. Did you hear about the new, like, TikTok discovery? What? Um, there's this guy who films his grandma saying, like, how she does stuff. Um, apparently Irish spring soap, like the, the bar soap. <gasps> yeah. If you rub that on the outside of your uh, door frames I, and windows. I thought I started following them. I don't follow them. I just saw the thing. It, like, keeps out bugs and insects and stuff? Yeah. You need to do that. I There's if one where she um, puts, I, I want to say it Cause... was baking soda on anthills. Yeah. Uh, and I've seen an old guy say that WD-40 keeps, like, wasps and stuff from, like, putting up nests on your... Can I tell you, I love the WD-40 guy. Yeah. I love him. He oh, comes up nice. with the most amazing things that you can do with WD-40. I don't know if he was love the that guy. WD-40 guy, but... Like, that's a really good idea, though, like, putting some kind of chemicals. And, like, also there was a guy who was talking about the the Irish soap thing because he is a licensed uh, pesticide person. I don't know what the word yeah. is. Um, but he was saying, actually, there is a chemical in that that does uh, keep bugs and stuff away. 
But also, if you want to make like a home bug spray, uh -huh. um, it's just peppermint and rosemary, like peppermint oh. oil, essential oil yeah. that you water down. And uh, I think it was peppermint. Was it peppermint? It might, it might have been something else, but like an oil, one of those oils and like rosemary and you just water it down and use it as like bug spray instead of buying like the stuff that's really expensive. Yes. Yes. <laughs> So Irish Spring actually works. I don't well, know. I, I don't know if it, it does. I haven't tried it, but I want to it, though because we have a huge wasp problem here. Yeah. And also we have a squirrel problem. And if it works for like rabbits, I'm assuming it works for squirrels. Uh, I, I just know. want them out of the house. Like I don't want them on the house. Yeah. I don't care about if they're around and on the trees and stuff or right. on the roof. Just like Get out of my room, inside of my house. My, I don't my, want you to climb in. What's that called? Because we uh, have squirrels. Because you know that that part of our house that's on the second floor with those windows? Mm -hmm. Squirrels will, like, cling to the windowsill on the outside and, like, climb around that. Oh and I'm like, you're going to die. <laughs> Stop. Are you still using the threes? Hey, now. Hey, now. This is what dreams are made of. Man, Lizzie Blot McGuire, everybody. Yeah, you can't go back and get that back. It's. They tried. Lizzie you McGuire? just can't. They tried to remake Lizzie McGuire? Was it Lizzie McGuire or was it something else? I thought it was oh, Lizzie McGuire. They tried I think so. That would be insane. I... That is That show is only possible in the early 2000s. Exactly. <laughs> Well, there's a lot of shows that need to stay in their generation because they just don't work in other generations. Yeah. It's like sitcoms. It's not really a thing that you can do anymore. Oh, I don't believe that. But really? Yeah. I guess I just don't watch sitcoms. Yeah. I think sitcoms... It's outdated and out of touch. I do love when really like, people on TikTok will take like sitcom or like friends episodes yeah. and like remove the laugh track. Yeah. And it, it's just like that wasn't funny. People just laughed in the background so you chuckled. <laughs> There's yeah, a lot of sitcoms are like that though. I mean if you go back and watch uh Seinfeld, you'd be like, oh my gosh. But it was a good show. But I will also say is... that the Carol Burnett show was a good show. <laughs> so Seinfeld was one of those shows where adults watched it and I was like, why the fuck would you ever watch this instead of Pokemon? Like, this <laughs> is the most great. dry and boring, <laughs> like, waste of everybody's time. No, it was great. But I've never watched it as an adult. I've, I think oh, really? I cried a couple of times and I was like, this is boring. I don't get it. Wow. But uh, like, I don't get 90%. Which there's of the... a lot of references yeah, in there that you wouldn't get. Exactly. Like, yeah. that's the thing. Because like Gilmore Girls, I don't know 90% of the references that they make. Really? Anything. Yeah, because it, it was written for people older than. You know, oh. Because. And their speed of talk, I, I think, is what made them mo more popular. But. Um... But, the like, they have you... a lot of, like, cultural, like, niche cultural, yes. like, commentary and yes. jokes that I just don't get because I was a child during those right. periods of time, so I wouldn't get it. Okay, so... But there is, like, a whole TikTok account um, dedicated to explaining their, like, two-second jokes. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. That's funny. It's kind of cool. Funny. No. Cool. Funny? I hear you saying funny. Do, do, do. Okay, stop. I'll stop. Don't turn the channel, please. No, not turn the channel. Don't play the next song. Guess her age. <laughs> Oh gosh. Goddamn <laughs> it's been a long day, Kelsey. Hey, you didn't have to work today. It's interesting because it's. I've had. I only had Corey twice this week. But I'm going to have him tomorrow, too. 
Okay. So we started doing a um, crystal. We're growing our own crystal. Oh, yeah. Can I tell you last night, it was the coolest thing. I walk into the bedroom and the whole room is glowing and green because of this crystal in the jar. That's cool. I didn't know it was glow in the dark. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I took a really cool picture of it. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Isn't that cool? It was just glowing. That's cool. So bright. But it's actually springing a little root. Yeah, you know crystals grow, right? Like normal. Yeah, that's... Yeah. So we're growing one in a jar at the house. That's and cool. Yeah. I've always wanted to get one of those kits where you can grow like your own like gems and stuff. Yeah. That's uh, one. I just never had. You didn't have a cool mom. Yeah. Or he has a cool grandma. And a poor mom. <laughs> That's really what it came. Because you know how like you would go into Walmart as a kid and you're like, man, I want this cool science kit. Yes. But they were like way overpriced yeah. for the garbage that was inside of them. Yeah, we never got the cool science kit. Okay, I will buy one for your house and we will start it here. <laughs> yeah. We'll it set is it a in the process. Oh, you I have to like that. boil water oh, and oh. then stir for two minutes oh, and then wow. wait for 10 minutes and then you can put the rock in there, but you can't touch it with your hands mm -hmm. and you can only use metal. Oh. You can't use any other. Uh, it, it was a whole process. Intense. But the funny thing was, Corey wanted to keep it secret from Grandpa. Oh. Because when Grandpa saw it, he would be so amazed that he would kiss me. Okay. <laughs> then you can stop watching Disney. And I, said, I said, but boys don't kiss girls until they're in their 20s. Okay? <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> You could have gone to the whole. I don't need him to go to school. And you say, could have gone to the whole hog and be like, "You gotta me. be married before you kiss." No, no, oh, that's stupid. Yeah, of course. It is. Living together yeah. before you're married is stupid too. So, or I mean, not, not living together yeah. before you're married is stupid too. And I would be kind of a hypocrite if I said that you had to live together before you got married. We had children. I would have just laughed at you, like, okay, I'll live in Sundays. We had whole children before we were married. A whole child, not children. You had one child. A child. Unless there's something you're not telling me. Uh, <laughs> so there's some secrets. No, <laughs> no I have one age. child. What? Before at, you were married. When we got, yeah, before we were married. <laughs> Get Rex to him. Oh, gosh. <laughs> No, nope, you can blame your sister for this family. Blame away, blame away. Which, unfortunately, your sister followed my... My, uh... What's it called? Mistake? <laughs> path. Oh, sure. Same path, I took. Egregious life altering But mistake. she was older than I was, so there's that. That makes it okay? No, it makes it better. She was at least older. Okay, guess. Yeah, so. 